Good evening, guys. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, please like uh, this video and subscribe to our channel. If you're watching on the team page, go and do the exact same. Share the love. Um, so, uh, yes, those of you who don't know me and maybe watching on YouTube, uh, my name is Nathan Warburton. I'm a sensor consultant here in Australia. Um, and I'm going to be doing a little bit of training with you guys tonight. Um, so those of you who are watching on the team page, uh, I had a few people ask me um, about a, a post I did today, uh, which was the um, deal of the day post where I shared it from my business page, my Facebook business page, um, and I had tagged some products in there. Um, and those tags directly linked to our PWS and people wanted to know exactly how I did that. So um, rather than try and answer multiple messages, um, I thought I would show you guys. So this is what this video is. So I'm going to quickly share the video. Now I do apologize for the graininess. Um, my computer really, really hates me. Our awesome, we have an awesome um, MBN internet service, but for some reason my computer just hates me tonight. But anyway, Let's share the screen so you guys can see my computer. So as you can see, I am on our business page, uh, the Saint Guy Sensi Independent Directors. Um, and this is the culprit um, <laughs> post uh, that I had so much people ask me about. So this is the reason why we're doing this video. So as you can see, I've done the post. Um, it, you know, deal of the day, it's got the, the, the product um, video, sorry, the product um, photo, um, as well as just down the bottom here where you see the cursor moving, uh, product shown, and it says Sensi um, or Flare Sensi Warmer with the price and so forth. Now, what these are, are these little buttons. So your customers, when you share this post, can simply click on your post, if it's going to do it, and it's going to bring this up. Now, um, this is still on Facebook. Um, and what's cool about uh, this is when they click on this, it will have the product, it will have the product details, and it will have the button where, you, where it will be sent directly to your PWS. So the um, check out on website button will take them directly to your PWS to the exact product. Now, what's pretty cool about this is by doing, um, and by doing this and tagging products, um, you're giving yourself a little bit more information. So by rather than just doing a standardized post on your personal page or your business page and not tagging products, um, means that you, you, you don't see what people um, are doing, whether people are clicking on the post, whether they're viewing it, um, whether they're clicking to go to your website, you don't know any of that. But because you're tagging the actual products on your business page, it's going to do that and for you, it's gonna, you know, Calculate all that for you, but also going to show you that. So as you can see up here, um, I shared this post um, an hour or so ago, um, and it states that there's already been three views. So with the views, it's people clicking on the actual product um, tag, which brings this page up. So there's been three people that have viewed this exact page that is showing right now, and one person has clicked on the checkout website. Now, when your customers click on the checkout website, it's going to direct them straight to the actual product on your PWS. How cool is that, right? Awesome. So let me show you guys how to do it because I'm going to show you how to do this tonight. So let's close that down. Let's move my ugly mug out of the road just for a moment so I can close this. There we go. Now, it's as simple as going to your business page. Now, you need a business page to be able to tag products, um, uh, not a VIP group, okay? Now, groups are fantastic, they're awesome. Um, we have both, Matt and I, we have uh, both the business page, as you can see here, and we also have a VIP group. Now, our VIP group is an awesome way to interact uh, personally with our customers that have purchased an office previously, but the business page is also awesome where you can actually go ahead and tag products like this. Um, you can um, do paid advertising, so you can boost your posts um, and, and have those um, posts displayed to people that um, you wouldn't normally have seen these posts um, and you're paying for them. So um, 
Facebook tends to favor these posts more than a VIP post, so to speak, or a personal post. So to do this, as I said, you need a business page to so go to your business page. Um, you can do this on your phone as well, and it's gonna look very similar to this, um, but you're just gonna to have to flick in and out of the, um, the app and go back and forth to um, the PWS and all that to grab links and stuff. But anyway, so I'll show you on this. I think it's a little bit more simpler. Um, so we scroll right up to the top um, where it says write something. So you simply just click on there. Eventually. As, as I said, my computer really doesn't like me tonight. So what we want to do is we clearly want to um, do a post. Um, so we want, uh, do it in caps, uh, deal of the day, say 20%. Whoa, that's not 20, that's 20. Now, um, you don't specifically have to do tags just for the deals of the day. You can do them for any products um, or any types of posts at all. Um, and I'll show you a few of them before um, we finish up this training as well. So pretty much um, it's as simple as, you know, doing your little spill. Um, tonight we're going, I'm going to show you how to do uh, uh, this, obviously, but I'm going to um, do the uh, Sensi Tiger's Eye Warmer. So they're in your sales section of your PWS. So if you don't know how to go to that, you go to your PWS, go to the specials and click clearance and it will bring up all the clearance products. So. We're now on the Tiger's Eye uh, product page. Simply just highlight that, click it, copy it, click it, copy it, um, and then head back over to uh, the business page. I like to just copy and paste, make it easier for me rather than me having to type everything out. And then I simply get the description. Now there's gonna be a little bit of back and forth and doubling up, but I'll show you why. So. I just simply do that, that's all done. Um, and I wanna add photos. So I simply click on here, add photos. Um, I'm gonna select the deal of the day first. So that's the first photo that's gonna be shown. And then I'm going to select the product photo, which is um, now, what I find is some of the product photos on the PWS are pretty standard. They're not anything flashy or anything else like that. So with the um, Tiger's Eye uh, warmer today, uh, instead of using this as the, um, the post photo, I'm going to use this awesome photo that I downloaded off Google by going to Google and searching Sensi Tiger's Eye warmer. So I've downloaded this photo and, and that's what we're going to do. We're going to leave that there as that photo. Now, to tag the products and to create your product, it's quite simple. You'll see this button here where it says tag a product. Simply click on that. Now, here is some that I've already made previously. You just simply scroll down and click add a product. You want to add a photo. So with the photos um, for this, I've simply just gone to um, the PWS and uh, save the actual photo um, that the PWS has. So it's simply just clicking on that photo um, or right clicking on, on, on a computer or just holding it down on an iPhone or a phone and clicking save with the phone and you just, you know, save the image to download. And that's what I simply did with that prior. So once you've uploaded that photo from the PWS, you click use photo. And it's as simple as doing what we just did on the post. We're selecting the, oops. Yeah, you'll see what I mean. I'm clicking over here, but it's not liking it. There we go. So it simply is copy and paste. You can type it out. I just find it easier to copy and paste. Um, we want to click here where it says, um, so this is an option. If it's a sale item, I like to show that it's a sale item. So you can click here where it says, this is a um, sale item. So what was the original price? The original price was 69. So we simply type in 69. Whoa. As I said, my computer loves me, doesn't it? Um, and then what's the on special price? So the special price is 5520. 
So we go down to the sale price and type 55.20. Now, we go back over to the PWS, copy the description. And paste it Oops. simply in the description. Now, this little part here where it says checkout URL, that is the link that um, you're going to add there from the PWS product. Um, and by putting the link in here, um, it creates that checkout on um, website link um, button that we had. So it's as simple as clicking over here, um, clicking up the, the top uh, URL, URL bar um, and copying that. Okay. And then we simply go down here and paste it in. Okay. Um, and it is as simple as that. It's done. So we're just going to click, click save. And it's saved. So that product is now saved. Um, uh, and it's going to show up on your Sensi uh, store, your shop, um, on your business page. Now, the post is here. It's awesome. You can simply publish it now where it says publish now. Um, and it will create that post with the tag products. Um, what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to show you how to schedule products as well. Um, so you can actually schedule this um, product um, to post on a different time or a different day, different month. So um, I've already gone ahead and I've loaded some of these products already. Um, and I've got a deal of the day happening, you know, now until, you know, Tuesday of next week. So um, this will be for Wednesday next week. So to schedule the post, um, you simply just click over here. As I said, if you don't want to schedule it, you just click publish now and it will post on your business page um, the exact same way as that um, Sensi Flare Warmer post will show. So we're going to schedule it and we're going to click schedule. And I love this because, you know, you can sit down for five or 10 minutes, probably a little bit longer than five or 10 minutes, but you know, say maybe half an hour um, and create one of these deals of the day or create posts um, and tag your products um, for the next week, you know, and just keep on scheduling them. So um, what happens by scheduling the post, this, the post will actually not be posted on your business page until the time that you've selected it to be posted. So you've scheduled it. Um, so I'm gonna simply just click here on the calendar. Um, we are going to schedule it for Tuesday. Let's go for Tuesday. And I like scheduling first thing in the morning. So we'll just change the time. And schedule. It is simple as that. It's now scheduled. How cool is that? So as I said, if you're not going to schedule it and you want to post it there and then, um, your post will come up exactly like that. Okay. If you schedule a post, it's going to come up exactly like that when you're selected. So when you've selected for it to be posted, does that make sense? I hope so. Awesome. And then what's cool about it as well is all those products that you've added as a product of the day or a deal of the day are going to be sitting up in this little thing that says the shop and it's going to have all these products sitting there for you for your customers to view when they go through rather than having to scroll through you know if that if that deal of the day or whatever the post you've done is an old post it's going to have all of it sitting up the top or if it's on a mobile it's going to be simply sitting on the side where it says uh, shop shop or shop now um, and it's as simple as that your customers can click on it and go to the page on your PWS. Um, so I hope that's answered a lot of your questions. As I said, it is quite easy to actually schedule posts. It's quite easy to tag products. Um, I'm going to probably spend a couple of days over the next few weeks to try and just schedule a whole heap of these um, tagged posts um, for the next week or two. Um, and hopefully, um, you know, I don't have to deal with my business page, which is, it's awesome to deal with my business page, but um, rather than have to deal every day with trying to figure out posts that I want to put on there. And I can use that time to simply answer any questions um, that any of our customers um, or our page likers um, post um, or answer, you know, um, messages that they may want to place in order. So 
it's awesome to be able to go and do it, do these things, tag products, and also to go ahead and schedule them. So I hope I've answered a lot of your questions. As I said, if you're watching on YouTube, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. Bye. <laughs> okay, now if I can end it. <laughs> Stop video. Stop share.